Hello friends, in this session we are going to discuss a SQL join query question which came in gate 2018. So this is a very simple question and uh, the one who knows the basics about the joins can easily get through this one. So let's discuss this question and let's see what was the questionnaire's perspective in this question. So the first uh, statement of the question states that there are two schemas given over here. So there are two schemas which is a book schema and a stock schema. Both of them have ISBN as the primary key and then we have a B name which might be a book name and a copies over here which represents the copies respect, with respect to this ISBN value. right? So now they state that there are four queries given over here and the question that they ask after the, uh, specifying these four queries are uh, question is after the four queries which they have specified is that which one of the queries above is certain to have an output which is a superset of the outputs of the other three queries. So question is very clear. He is asking that which one of the query produces the set of tuples which tend to be a superset of the rest of the three. Fine. So let's see the queries. What are the queries given to us? So the first query says select, select this and this from book inner join S on b.isbn is equals to s.isbn. So this is a simplistic case of inner join. Then query 2, what does it state? It states that select b.isbn, s.copies from book b left outer join stock s on b.isbn equals to s.isbn so this is a simplistic query for left or left outer join similarly the third one is a case of right outer join and the fourth one is a case of full outer join so as we all know that the tuples produced by the full outer join are superset of the ones produced by inner join or a left outer join or a right jo a right outer join the answer is directly d part query 4 so i'll just uh, give you a recap of the all the three concepts inner join <coughs> left outer join and right outer join so inner join is one in which you get only those tuples which match the stated condition so, which match the equality condition in our case. Left outer join gives you the tuples which match the condition. That is the matching tuples. And also in addition to these, it also gives the non-matching tuples of the left hand side relation. That is non-matching tuples of book relation in this case. And for the right outer join, you will get matching tuples plus the non-matching tuples of the right side relation which is the stock relation for full outer join what do you get you get the matching tuples plus the non matching tuples of the left hand side relation plus the non matching tuples of the right hand side relation so very simply you can just analyze that obviously the full outer join is the superset of all these three because it is containing the sum of all the three of all the three outputs right so that's all for this question. I'm going to see you all with some more Gate 2018 questions in the upcoming videos. So till then, stay tuned and happy learning. Thank you.